Hey hi everyone this is admin from admin365 and today we are going to talk about how to turn on litigation hold on a mailbox so let's get started so to be able to turn on litigation hold on a mailbox it does require a specific license uh, litigation hold is a premium feature which does not allows the emails to be deleted permanently even after the user deletes it it stores the email to a separate location which is not accessible to the user but can be retrieved by doing a content search on the mailbox as it is a premium feature it it is only available for users who are on exchange online plan to license for the user who has exchange online plan one license it is not available it is only available on the subscription which include exchange online plan to or a standalone exchange online plan to subscription so the subscription which include exchange online plan to uh, some of them are e3 and e5 subscription we can also get standalone subscription which provides us the exchange online plan 2 and the exchange online plan 2 basically provides us 100 gigabytes of storage plus auto expanding archive which is basically unlimited archive so let's see how we can turn it on for a user account which has exchange online plan 2 license assigned to it so uh, for us to turn it on we just have to go to office.com and sign in with the global admin account or exchange administrator should be fine as well and once you are on this page you can simply click on the admin tile if you don't see the admin tile you simply have to click on the nine dots on the top which is called as app launcher and then click on the admin tile and once you click on it it will open this page with the url admin.microsoft.com we simply have to scroll down and click on show all if you don't see all the options here and once you click on show all you will see all the admin centers which are listed we simply have to click on the exchange admin center and we can simply get rid of this so for example if i want to turn on litigation hold for this mailbox which is a user mailbox i will simply click on the name and it will open a window from the right as you can see in here we'll have to click on the others tab and here you will find the option litigation hold manage litigation hold we simply have to click on it and it gives us an option to turn it on currently it is turned off for the user and as you can read on the top when litigation hold is turned on for a mailbox user can remove items from their mailbox but those item will still be saved by office 365 and those items can be retrieved by content search so uh, we just simply have to turn it on and then specify the duration we want to hold the deleted emails for you simply can mention here the days you want to hold the data or you can simply leave it blank for unlimited hold duration and it will only be turned off when you manually turn it off for the user account and you can add a note if you want that your mailbox is on litigation hold do not delete any item it is visible for the user in the mailbox and you can provide a url to the user when clicked on it uh, it will show more information but that's fine you can simply keep these two options blank and simply keep this blank if you want to hold it for infinite duration and then hit save changes it will only be turned off if you manually come back to this place and turn it off for the user so we'll go ahead and save it and as it says that it can take up to 60 minutes to 
for the changes to take effect and after 60 minutes uh, any email a user deletes should be retained in the recoverable items folder if you want to turn it off for a user you simply have to click on the user again and then go to others and then click on manage litigation hold and you simply have to turn it off from here and then save changes so there you go guys this was how we can turn litigation hold on in office 365 uh, do let us know if you have any questions and any query and until then you have a nice day bye take care